Hi, this is uh, John Pinto, and I'm uh, here at uh, 1717 Hearst Avenue in San Jose uh, doing a walkthrough, waiting for the buyer to come by. And uh, I thought I'd make this an educational video to give uh, buyers an idea of how to conduct a walkthrough. I'm uh, with Realty World Pinto & Associates, 408-829-4141. Uh, email is johnpinto at jvpinto.com. So anyway, we could see that the garage door is relatively new, sectional garage door. All the uh, concrete in the driveway is in good shape. It looks like uh, you've got a 30-year uh, dimensional shingle roof up there that wasn't installed over another roof, uh, although we'll leave that to the uh, roofer. Uh, to ascertain uh, the uh, landscaping is in good shape so we can make the uh, leap that the uh, sprinklers are probably working and uh, we don't see a lot of uh, horizontal cracks down by the uh, bottom of the house near the foundation as you can see. Tile entry looks like it's in pretty good shape and uh, we do have some spotting in the carpet although I think it could get cleaned and it's a deep flush and it looks like it's okay. Um, this triple bay window is probably not original construction, so it probably wouldn't be a bad idea to check the, uh, the permits on record. Uh, likewise, uh, this uh, vaulted ceiling is probably not original construction. Checking out the uh, permits uh, wouldn't be a bad deal. Um, so now we are over into the kitchen. And uh, it looks like we don't have an original kitchen. It's been remodeled probably in the last 10 years. Uh, of course, we will have the uh, home inspectors uh, checking on all the appliances. So uh, we do have, uh, again, vaulted ceilings in the uh, family kitchen and uh, double pane windows. So uh, by the way, as foreclosures go, and this is a foreclosure, it's a fairly clean house and, uh, and very improved. And uh, looking at the uh, fireplace, we just want to check out the uh, fireplace to make sure that uh, the firebox looks good and there doesn't seem to be any excessive uh, deterioration of mortar or the fire brick lining. Uh, so that is good. Now we'll go into the uh, backyard and uh, again the exterior stucco uh, looks like it's in uh, good shape it does look like it was re-stuccoed at one time which potentially could mask over a problem uh, but uh, I don't think that's the case here uh, we do have uh, gutters and downspouts in place uh, we do need some paint uh, by the uh, fascia boards uh, and it doesn't seem like there's a lot of uh, termite uh, damage uh, under the eaves. <laughs> We've got a uh, little wood step out here, which may have a little fungus underneath, but uh, that's not a big deal. Uh, the vents are in place to keep uh, the critters out. Rats, possums, mice, cats, what have you. If we look at this stucco wall, it looks fairly straight. There's not a lot of bowing at the bottom. And it does look like we've had some new service put in here, new electrical service. And uh, we have a solar power conditioner. I wonder what that is. Uh, maybe there's some solar panels on the roof. So uh, going back to the uh, backyard, uh, it looks like the uh, fencing all the way around has been uh, replaced recently. The posts look like they're at 90 degrees and uh, pretty erect. And uh, you've got a nice big backyard uh, uh, facing west, so you'll get a lot of uh, sun back here. And uh, not a lot of road noise, by the way. Do have central air conditioner. Uh, so we have to make sure we get that included in the home warranty. And ah, there are the solar panels. And again, more gutters. And uh, doesn't look like you have a lot of cracking in the um, 
and the exterior of the fireplace stucco. It doesn't look like the fireplace is uh, pulling away. So, uh, probably not a bad idea to put a handrail on uh, these stairs to make sure somebody doesn't uh, take a header. Nice breakfast bar. That will come in very handy. Uh, we do have a refrigerator here. Get a better look at the front of the refrigerator. Looks pretty old. Probably be better off buying a new one that's energy efficient, but we'll make sure we get that included in the home 